if you have a custom Lego minifigure review from Mini Bigs, if you want to check out the videos, they right up here, or links will be down below. We have some of the, I think these ones came out this year, newer minifigs. Uh, we got some Spider-Man ones, of course. Uh, we have the Miles Morales minifigure, uh, fully pad printed, comes with an extra head and a sticker. And we also have the uh, wrestling Spidey guy. Uh, we'll start with this one, because the Miles Morales one is really cool. So, uh, this is their, I think that's the name of him, is the Wrestling Spidey Guy. I believe these ones are still on site, so the link will be down below for sure. Um, it is fully pad printed in-house by Mini Bigs, and he always does a great job with these mini figures. Um, of course, starting at the head, so it's one of the dark blue heads. Uh, we have the Spider-Man eyes. You can kind of see how they... Flare up to a point, so we got the red outside with the white inside, and typically, if you've seen the Spider-Man movies, um, they move so you can kind of get more emotion out of the face. Um, no mouth, so it kind of looks like a, like um, be like a ski mask style uh, face. It looks really good though. Again, pad printing is very clean. Um, you, you, you know, you can't feel it. Doesn't even need an outline, and you can tell the style of the face. Coming down to the chest and torso, I really like this because it's like a crew neck style, reminds me of like a Christmas sweater, um, but it is a Spider-Man um, uh, Spider crew neck, so you can see the collar, it's that stretchy material, we have a nice Spider-Man logo in the center, again very clean, just all one stamp, looks really good. And then a little bit on the lower portion of the torso, again that's that stretchy, like elast not elastic, but like... The stretchy material that typically wraps around like the waist of the mini of this minifig at least. And then minifig can come apart, doesn't hurt the printing at all, of course. And then coming down further, we have the he's wearing the sweatpants. Uh, you can see the little knot at the waist, but nothing else on the front of the legs in the dark blue color matching the face. Coming to the side of the minifig. Uh, no printing on the side of the arms, body, waist, or legs. Uh, light flesh tone hands or light nougat, whatever the color is. Same thing as this side. We got the no printing on the side of the body, arms, legs, or waist. Light flesh tone hands. But coming to the back of the minifigure, we do have that crew neck design again. We have the collar, a very big Spider Man logo on the back. Again, print quality is great. And then we have the that like elastic style waistband on the bottom of the sweater or sweatshirt or crew neck. So this one's pretty much just a torso and face print other than the waist, of course. The nice thing about this is the sweatpants can go on any minifig. But uh, this one really went well because the Miles Morales minifig is also Spider-Man. They also had, um, uh, minifigs also had a bunch of... Uh, Different style misprints, I believe, of this one. So you could have gotten, like, some cool, crazy, wacky colors. That's what he's been doing a lot on his recent releases. And I know that that same thing for the case of the Miles Morales Spider-Man figure. Is there was a lot of different style uh, colors. Um, Overmold prints. And uh, there was also the retro ones, which are the old Lego torsos with the... Um, what do you call them? The, like, Lego torsos... With just the bumps as the arms, not the opposable arms. But now on to the very cool minifig, the Miles Morales one. Uh, you can see it comes in just the Ziploc baggie, but it does come with a sticker. Get him out here. does come with two heads. And you'll be able to see, when I was talking about that emotion in the Spider-Man eyes, you'll be able to see that with this one. So we, of course, have the... Um, Miles Morales Spider-Man minifig sticker. It's kind of mine kind of got beat up probably because of the packaging. Um, he's got a Spider-Man sp spider sense tingling the the Peter tingle. He's not Peter. He's Miles, but um, his logo in the background, of course. This was designed by Michael McHugh. Uh, love him. He does my thumbnails and everything. So shout out to him as well. Nice mini bigs logo on the bottom. And it's a good size sticker, palm size. Now onto the minifigure. I like this head that's on there a lot already. So full, full black suit with the red accents on there. Very nice. Um, of course, starting at the face, you can see the Spider-Man eyes. So he's got the flare-ups on the points. Very wide-eyed. If you look at this one, 
you can see the similarities in the red design and that gives you a good look at like the um, emotion in the eyes so if this was helmet was the the black one you could see it like him being wide-eyed to like being angry or like peering through something and then we also have this head which is the super like squinting one but again from those three you can tell the emotion in the face of the minifigure without even having a mouth or eyebrows which is really cool and they, like I said really good job by doing that I do like the other head so maybe I'll put both on for now so there we go so you can see the two heads that come with it and then coming down to the chest and torso we have the uh, big Miles Morales logo on the chest the spider looks really good the points are very clear you can see the circle around it and then the uh, muscle like contour underneath so his chest his ribs uh, coming down to like the waist area in that lighter gray color coming down to the waist and legs nothing on the upper waist nothing on the legs we do have the red trim on the bottom of the shoes or boots of the suit nice little red line at the bottom coming over to the side of the minifigure no printing on the side of the arms or hands but we do have printing on the side of the body waist and legs that nice little trim line coming all the way down that red accent in line very well down the center and then we have printing on the lower shoes as well Coming over to the other side of the body, same thing. We have that uh, printing on the side of the body, waist and legs, that red line accent coming all the way down. And then you also have the bottom of the shoes there. No printing on the side of the arms or hands. And then coming around to the back of the minifigure, we have another uh, different style logo. It's a little bit different. Um... We can still see it's the Spider-Man logo coming down this time. Done very well. It's a little different. I like it. Would have been nice to see some maybe some like back accenting. I know typically you could do the spine, shoulders, same waist design on the back. Just to mimic it a little more detail. And then coming to the back of the legs. Nothing on the waist, legs, but there is printing on the lower feet. And you can see that red line does go all the way around on the minifigure of course for the bottom of his suit really like this minifigure the Spider-Man ones from Lego are good as well but I like the custom ones a lot and the dual heads you could I mean if if maybe Mini Bigs makes a bunch of other heads that would be really cool you have like a Spider-Man head pack especially if you do it with like this one I'd really like to see this head for the Miles Morales one just you have that variation between the eyes and if you do them you could have wide eyed and like you could keep going down and like stop motion wise you could have them like where he's blinking by just changing the head and you don't have to like edit it but very cool minifigures um I love the Spider-Man ones they're really cool the Marvel like Marvel superhero minifigures I've always liked um links will be down below for these minifigures so you can be sure to check them out I think the wrestling one's still on there. I don't know. I think Miles Morales sold out a while ago. Uh, if I do find a link, I'll put it down below. Um, I can't wait to get some more mini big stuff. I do have some stuff to get to, so I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, if you want to check out my other videos of mini bigs, you can click right up here. Our links will be down below. Be sure to leave a like if you haven't liked the video and subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. And as always, thanks for watching.